Oh, hi guys, today we are in Hot Spots. Welcome back to Xenio and today we are going to show you about the traditional Singaporean breakfast. So this set, this is a traditional Singaporean breakfast with uh, two eggs, kaya toast and whatever coffee or tea that you want. Lah. In this case, this is a coffee tea. If you would like something different, you can follow us uh, and start ordering this uh, multi-grain chicken floss and this is a multi-grain peanut butter the trick is to order a la carte and you can order it cheap because if it's a set it'll cost about six dollars but you order a la carte it'll only cost two dollars and this is my drink for today this is a uh, tasty siu thai Okay. So, as the saying, an old saying goes, you eat breakfast as a king, you have lunch like a prince, and you have dinner like a pop. Yeah. So th this is our king set. So we come to the second part of the video where I explain what is kaya toast. So inside kaya toast, right? This toast has butter and kaya. Kaya is a sweet coconut Malay uh, paste okay and it's mixed with butter so it's sweet with it becomes less sweet when you mix it together so this is the usual traditional one for this one right this chicken floss you can see it's, there is some oil and chicken floss so that it can stick to this uh, multi-grain okay. and then in this multi-grain toast you have uh, peanut butter and it's cut into this uh, small squares which make it very easy for you to share share it together with friends so these are not traditional these are modern but uh, we like this taste la. so you can check out the menu for toast box to find out more of the uh, modern bread taste and okay this is how you open the uh, egg okay. this is half boiled egg so many la. A few moments later. Okay, so half boiled egg, then you mix a bit of soy sauce and pepper, white pepper. So that's it. Then you mix it around. Delicious. Now we come to the part 3 of this video. So I'm going to explain to you what is the traditional coffee in Singapore. So there is a lot of variations. So we can start with uh, normal black coffee with condensed milk. That's coffee. Then coffee peng is black coffee condensed milk with ice. Peng means ice. Like. Okay, kopi o siu thai, which is black coffee with less sugar. Kopi o means just black coffee. Kopi kosong means unsweetened black coffee. Kopi kosong peng means unsweetened black coffee with ice. Kopi o peng means sweet black coffee with ice. Kopi kadai means <laughs> black coffee with extra condensed milk. Kopi po means weaker coffee with condensed milk and kopi kao means strong coffee with condensed milk and kopi si means coffee which is with evaporated milk si is for carnation it's a brand in singapore so that's why they call it kopi si uh, i think that's all actually there are many more but i'm not gonna go through every each and every one of them so uh, the, for the taste, for the tea, it's the same. Te si, te o, te 
Kada, they see you die, whatever. So that, that's a lot. So uh, feel free to check it out and try uh, each and every one of them. And once you get your preferred choice, you can keep on ordering it. So ask the waiter if you need any help on choosing your own preferred Singaporean coffee or tea. So that's all from us. Hope you learned something about the classic Singapore breakfast and something a bit, um, a bit more about Singapore. So thank you guys. Do click the like button if you enjoyed this video and do subscribe to XNU. So that's all from us. We want to have our breakfast right now. Thank you. Bye bye.